Hey guys, I got an empty trailer here. I'm gonna go pick up a vehicle. Kind of a long road trip that started really late. Like this thing didn't pop up until like noon. And now I'm taking like a five hour trip one way. Okay. Okay, I know you guys cannot see anything. But I'm back home. It was a long day, and uh, my trailer is empty. Empty trailer. Um, and actually, it's after midnight. That means it's officially 4th of July. So, stay safe, enjoy the weekend. I have to pay you, I want to pay you. That means you're gonna win a cup, and, and that's what the, the Blues did, and so they gave contracts to them, like, a break. What is up, guys? If I look tired, it's because I am tired. It's been a long day, and it's super hot outside. But I am on my way home from picking up another rock bouncer. I don't know, I bought a, I bought a second rock bouncer. My wife must think I am super awesome for needing to buy something else that I can't even drive on the street. But uh, yeah, another road trip. Just me and the Ram, hanging out, doing our thing. Still driving. Almost home though. I need to cut the top off of this buggy uh, and drop it down to where, it, near where it was when it was first built. It was raised up for uh, the tall owner of it. Um, but I need to drop it back down. I feel like I'm gonna wake up crazy early tomorrow and like immediately cut the roof off. And there it is guys. Buggy one. Buggy two. And my wife got me this fridge for my beverages so I don't have to walk up the mountain to get a cold drink. So that was nice. Okay, I'll pull it out of the shop and talk about it for a second. Talk about my weird, weird move I made. Obviously there is the uh, sticky traps on race lines right here and a spare over there. I personally just like the look of the cut 44s on it with the black beadlocks right now. I don't know. I guess I'm a little crazy. And when it comes to sticky tires, honestly, I find myself just being uh, an SX kind of guy. I don't know. All right. Is this thing on right now? Okay. Truth be told, I was actually on the prowl for uh, like a nice older truck, a dent side or another square body. I was becoming a little frustrated looking for an old truck. 
came home with this one night. I ended up messaging a guy who didn't try too hard to sell it. Um, it wasn't posted too many places, and I just asked if he still had it. He did, and I was like, I think I can get you the money tomorrow. So <laughs> I don't even know what my plans are for this thing, honestly. But I've changed some fluids, changed the oil. Obviously, I did the roof. When I was younger, this goes back like seven to nine years ago, and I was getting really into like rock bouncers. And you know, eventually I would end up with a, a new chassis and take on the build process myself. But uh, let's go back to like 2012, 2013. I was, I was trail riding with my Jeeps that I was swapping axles in, but it wasn't this. I always thought, you know, I'd see like a bouncer pop up for 45 grand. And not that I paid that for this. I'd be like, oh my gosh, that is the coolest vehicle on the planet. Like to just take a road trip and pick one of those up. It just sounds like a blast, you know, already done. I kind of got to live out a dream of mine from like eight, nine years ago. Uh, an opportunity presented itself and I kind of ran with it. It is incredibly stupid to own two rock bouncers. When I brought the buggy home, it had the 42 treps on it, on race lines. And uh, when I finished the tube work on top, I actually immediately put these on to kind of give it the vintage Tennessee look that I kind of grew up loving. It's obviously a rear steer buggy. I thought it'd be fun to mess around with that. And I feel like I would get myself into trouble trying to use it. I wanted to cosmetically kind of make it pretty again. Uh, you know, it could, whether it's, you know, a good detailing or I sanded down the links and repainted them black, you know, and just a bunch of odd and things like that. Just to kind of make it pop again. Uh, I kind of find that fun. Even though it's work, I also enjoy it. 